officers who killed Alfonso Limon, Don Erhart, Ernie Orozco, Jess Aragon, John Brislinger, Matthew Ross, Pedro Rodriguez, Rocky Marquez, Ryan Lochner, Zach Stiles. These are all active police officers except for one, I think Orozco, who retired. Did he receive any repercussions for taking an innocent life? Do you believe that these police officers who are active duty are good cops? Do you think they are? Maybe you'll say they just made a mistake. What happens when you go to work and you make a mistake, city council? Maybe you forget some paperwork, maybe you mispronounce someone's name. They made a so-called mistake and someone's son is dead. Someone's brother's dead. And you can look me in the eye and say, you're gonna send these cops out on our streets again? Once again, some of these cops are implicated in a second murder, taking away an innocent life again, and yet they are still on these streets active duty. So you're gonna wait three times a charm? You're gonna wait till it happens again? until you take some serious action here? You know who these people are, and yet you sit here complacent that they're doing a good job on our streets. What about all the other officers of Oxnard who work with them every day and who sit silently while there's racial profiling going on, when there's harassment of our youth day to day? What about those officers? They don't speak out against the abuse. So where are we? Where are, where are the good cops in Oxnard? That's my question for you. Because when I went to the press conference with the Limon family, I saw their sadness, I saw their grief. And I know that that is not a mistake, that is not a casual bureaucratic mistake. That is something that we need to fix immediately with the cameras that the Limon fam family requested on the police officers, and also with the civilian review board that will make sure that abuses do not just get looked over Oh, we're, we're going to forget now that you have an anti-violence day, we're all going to hold hands with the cops and say thank you for protecting us. We're not going to forget just because there's going to be a plaque now where Alfonso Limon, he lied down. He got out of the way. There was an altercation going on. He got out of the way. Remember, they tell you, don't run from the cops. Don't run. So he lied down on the side of the road. And you know what happened? He got shot 16 plus times. And you're gonna tell us that we're safe, our youth are safe with these cops on our streets? Just because there's a plaque there, we're gonna feel better about the situation? No, you need to take these officers off the streets now.